Hello and welcome to yet another video of Tracking the Changes, the series of videos that helps you understand what is new, what is different and what is changing across the digital domain and the real world and how to better synthesize the two together in order to gain a competitive advantage for your business and arguably your life. Thank you very much for the emails which you keep sending in which showcase your concerns. I keep taking into account and a lot of the videos that come out are a direct response to those concerns. And today we're going to talk a little bit about planning and complexity and dealing with the uncertainty that without a doubt we are all having to face right now. Now we all know that we live in a world that is completely fluid at this moment. This fluidity is best showcased by the uh, acronym VUCA which, is, which stands for volatility, uncertainty, complexity and ambiguity which are the four elements that face us pretty much with every problem that we um, tackle in terms of business and maybe even our lives. The question here is how do we successfully deal with this? And in order to deal with this we're going to have to borrow a technique from systems theory. Essentially everything is a system. We are a nested system as biological organisms. Business is a system, society is a system, even the country itself and the world at large are systems. Better understanding how these systems work together allows us to see what we can control, what we need to change, what we need to plan for and what we need to prepare in order to uh, better tackle the challenges that lie ahead. So essentially by applying that approach to our lives and our business we are able to systematically bring, break them down and better see their components. And this is what I'm going to ask you to do today basically. When the video is over essentially what you should do is Look at your business and see what kind of system it is. See what's, what is its operating system. What are the things which you do which are unique to you and which essentially characterize or um, highlight the aspect of your business which is essentially yours. Then check to see where your energy comes from. And I know you're going to say that energy is money. Yes it is, but that's like saying that we need oxygen in order to stay alive. We all need that. Uh, in, in the mammalian world on planet earth. So essentially that is not an answer. Energy can be uh, raw materials, it can be supplies, it can be your customer base, it can be any of those things. So you need to identify that. Once you identify your operating system and then you identify where the energy which you need comes from, then you begin to see where bottlenecks occur in those two components and what other surrounding components make up the system that is your business. It could be your buildings, it could be your, the machinery you use, it could be the software that you actually use to create something specific. Once you start to break this down then it begins to create a picture of all those things which are the system that is your business and then you need to see which of those are self-enclosed so that you control them and which rely on outside factors which are beyond your control. And that allows you to see the interaction that you need to create with others. It needs perhaps to gives you an idea of uh, what you need to do in order to face the challenges which come ahead because there's a certain amount of uncertainty in the um, management of specific components. It begins to show you how things are going to evolve even if you don't know. So that uncertainty is a thing in itself which needs to be taken into account. Not an easy video to make this one because there's so many different elements. There's going to be a lot more in-depth um, advice and articles in the description box below. Uh, so do follow those links. If you haven't subscribed to the videos, please think about doing so. Keep those emails coming in. I really hope this helps. Don't lose hope. Keep plugging on. Stay safe out there. Take care.